Roblox anime games in 2023 was in better words straight garbage. There were a few games that came out that had potential but for some reason developers struggle with good consistent content updates. But seriously what's what's up with that? However now we're in 2024 and there are a lot and I mean a lot of good games that are meant to come out this year that promise to bring something new to the table. So today, we are covering some of those games that are meant to be bringing new ideas to the platform. And the games we're going to be covering today may actually end up shaping what everybody's calling the golden era of Roblox games. Now, quick disclaimer, there are a lot of games coming out this year. This video is not meant to or intend to cover all those games. We're just specifically talking about a few games games a select few here so if you actually want me to make a 2024 roblox anime game breakdown you're gonna have to get this video to 1000 likes if we get 1000 likes i'll cover every single game that's meant to come out this year but if not we're sticking to the video script let's get straight into this first game we're going to be talking about is paradox now, what is Paradox bringing to the table that other Bleach games haven't actually brought? A good combat system. Now, we did have Type Soul in the past. However, everybody is comparing Paradox to Type Soul in its combat system. And the way it looks? Question mark? I don't think this game looks anything like Type Soul. However, the parrying system does look pretty good. One thing I'm good at analyzing is game's combat system. And usually, a lot of games add parrying to the game mechanics even though it doesn't actually suit it or they just get parrying completely wrong however in paradox you can tell the parrying is actually okay like it's really good it's, re it's responsive on top of the fact that the visuals look kind of cool i do think this game has a good combat system now usually bleach games come out and they don't really have good combat systems or if the gameplay is decent it's just bleach games on roblox aren't really that great however paradox does kind of catch my interest now i'm a little bit 50 50 because i don't know what progression is going to look like and it being a bleach game it's literally just going to be the same progression we've seen over and over and over again that's usually stale and bland yes bleach games don't have good progression however i'm not going to lie if they manage to do something cool with the progression on top of the fact that the combat system actually looks fluid this game could be pretty good it's a new bleach game everybody loves bleach however it's just bleach never really produces anything good on the platform so we're gonna have to wait and see for paradox but i do want to put paradox on this list because it the combat does look nice it looks nice next we have venture now i've spoken about venture on the channel before but venture is a souls like rpg game that really gives me that elden ring dark souls type of vibe this is the first time we're getting a game that looks and plays like venture is bringing that eerie dark souls feel on roblox to life whilst making it still look realistic and i'm not going to lie to you look at these sneaks it looks super immersive and usually when souls like games are made on the platform they, they're usually hit or miss there's always the combat's either mid or the game doesn't really feel like i'm playing it's not immersive enough for me but this looks like it has a good foundation the combat system looks souls like and the world around the game looks eerie and it looks cool so i can't wait to actually get into venture and play it next we have row fighters now row fighters was meant to go into early access on the 22nd of december however they ran into some problems so they delayed it for some time early 2024 and i'm actually assuming it's going to come out this month so this might be one of the first new games that we get on the platform now row fighters is a 2d platform fighter similar to something like street fighters or fighter z and this is the first time we're getting a fighting game of this style on the platform that actually feels and plays good i've played the game myself definitely enjoy it and i honestly think it's something you guys are going to enjoy too it's easy to get into however it has a, a a little bit of a steep learning curve you gotta learn the combos etc but i think everybody's gonna enjoy this game it's gonna get me it's gonna be getting frequent updates and the development team actually puts care and passion into the game something we don't see on the roblox too tough anymore now the next game is jujutsu infinite now jujutsu infinite's doing something we've never seen before especially with a jujutsu kaisen game not that there are any on the platform that are noteworthy anyways but jujutsu kaisen has a really 
fluid and in-depth combat system and the movement mechanics that go along with the combat system is different genuinely different we've not had a combat system that functions like this before and it's actually really nice now the part of jujutsu infinite that just kind of throws me off is the progression the pve it's honestly like it's worse than the bandit beater it's worse than the bandit beater so hopefully they end up revamping that part of the game it may take them a while to do that if they even decide to do that but i think that is going to be a huge blow in the game this might actually make or break the game in the future when it does come out this year is if they fix that pve the pve in this game is absolutely atrocious and there's no excuse for having such a good combat side to the game but the pve is very subpar hopefully they fix that if they do Jujutsu Infinite is going to be really crazy. Next, we have Pocket Anime. Oh my gosh, Pocket Anime. In terms of potential, Pocket Anime has unlimited, limitless potential. And I say that because Pocket Anime has the whole of anime and manga to work with. So there's unlimited content expansions. The game can have unlimited characters. The game could add to it. There's just so much content that Pocket Anime has in their hand that they can implement into their game. Hopefully it's done right. The only, the only reason that I'm a little bit scared about Pocket Anime is this whole DMCA nonsense that's been trending with GameFam because of GameFam and it's it's a little bit scary we're finally getting a really high caliber game that's not promises to will change the way we look at anime games on the platform and with that we have a lingering threat hanging over everyone hopefully other roblox developers allow pocket anime to 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 shine because really and truly it's the other developers hating in the corner that will be the reason why this game stands on fours hopefully pocket anime revamps and switches up some of the characters to names and maybe the way they look a little bit so that we don't have to worry about this game getting taken down but pocket anime looks amazing honestly i can't wait to get my hands on this i can't wait to actually play this this is definitely one of the games i'm definitely looking forward to this year probably more than everything holy war x now holy war x looks amazing uh obviously i wanted to spoil you guys with some special sneaks but alfie said no he said no he said no however that's okay holy war is cooking we haven't gotten sneaks in a while but trust me from what i've seen holy war looks amazing obviously we've seen the stuff that have been out to the public which is what you're seeing on the screen now but you guys have only seen like one percent of the game <laughs> honestly you guys have only seen one percent of the game this game is going to be crazy holy war x is the first good seven deadly sins game we're going to be getting on the platform with seven deadly sins inspired game we're going to be getting on the platform and honestly the things the mechanics that this game is bringing to the platform stuff we've never seen before for. And Rail Seas, the game everybody, the One Piece game everybody's looking forward to, the One Piece game that's just gonna completely revolutionize what we've been playing, what we've been experiencing. This whole going island to island, accepting a quest and bandit being and doing the same thing on the next island, the same thing on the next island, the same thing on the next island. It's done. It's finished in 2024. No more of that boring nonsense that we're used to, that we've been used to. We're finally gonna get to see some new gameplay. Real Seas is the most hyped game on the platform right now, the, the biggest upcoming game on the platform right now and not only does it promise, I guarantee you guys it probably will change the way everybody looks at Roblox anime games as a whole. I don't even need to speak too much, there's so much that's going to be done, there's so much that is being done and the rate at which the Rail Brothers and the dev team works on this game is astronomical. Revamping damn near the whole game within a day or two is honestly commendable things developers for games that are out right now take a year to do so honestly that's that and those are some of the games that are going to be shaping and revolutionizing the roblox anime platform in 2024 there's a lot to look forward to and there are a lot more games those were a lot of games but there are a lot more games coming out confirmed to be coming out this year that are literally gonna shake the platform so we're gonna have to wait there are a lot of games that might just come out the woodworks out of nowhere there's a lot of games that have been announced to come out this year and there are games that are assumed to be coming out this year but the development team aren't really that responsive we have a bunch of games there's a long list of potential games coming out this year that are definitely gonna make the platform a better place 
2024 is not only the year of gaming, it's the year of gaming on the Roblox platform, especially for the anime community. So hopefully we can keep going forward. The anime community grows every day and obviously we do have the game fam and the other developers trying to get IPs. Let's make sure they never see the light of day. <laughs> Anyways, if you guys do want to see the list of all the anime games coming out this year, telling y'all hit that like button bro because it, it's a long list i'm telling you if you want to see that list it's very long other than that i hope y'all have a great day happy new year i'm gonna see you guys in the next one peace